Okay, so let's try this problem on the Zener diode. See, first you can read the question carefully. Now, if you see, we have to find out the current through Zener diode. Now, this 5 volt which is written, okay, it's a potential difference across Zener diode. Now, this circuit diagram that you can see, it's normally called as a diagram for voltage regulator. See, in this circuit, the Zener diode works like a voltage regulator. Because of Zener diode, the voltage across this resistance is continuously maintained to be 5 volt. Zener diode maintains the voltage across this resistance. So this circuit is called voltage regulator circuit. Now here we have to find current through Zener. If you observe carefully, so here Zener is connected in the reverse bias. P side of the Zener is connected with negative terminal, N side with positive terminal. So already Zener is in the reverse bias. During reverse bias, if 5 volt applied or some particular voltage you have applied, so at this voltage, we can assume that Zener is in the breakdown region. Zener already undergo breakdown. So during breakdown region, current goes through Zener. Let's say it is IZ. The current which goes here, let's say it is I dash. And current going here, let's say I. Okay. So we have to find now IZ. So let's see how to find. First, on this resistance you start with. On this resistance, if I apply Ohm's law, that is V divided by R equals to I. So voltage across this resistance is also 5 volt. Same this 5 volt you can take here. Because these two are in parallel. The voltage you can take 5 volt. Resistance of this resistor you can take 2 kilo ohm, right? 2 into 10 power 3. So here current through this one I have written I dash. I dash comes. Solve it, I dash will come 2.5. 10 power 3, you take it in numerator, it becomes milliampere. So I dash is coming 2.5 milliampere. So this current is 2.5 milliampere. Now, if voltage across Zener is 5 volt, here also 5 volt will be there. So total voltage across this is 5 volt. The supply voltage is 10 volt. So you can understand that voltage across this will also be 5 volt. Because this voltage plus this voltage the sum of all voltages in the circuit should be equal to the emf of the cell so here 5 voltage drop is there so here also 5 will be there 5 plus this 5 should be total 10 so now on this resistance okay if we apply again ohm's law v by r equals to i so on this resistance if we apply so this v voltage is 5 volt again resistance 0 0.5 kilo ohm 0 0.5 into 10 power 3 this current I we will get. So just solve it, it is 10 milliampere will come. So this current is 10 milliampere. Now easily current through Zener we can find. Current through Zener will be equal to I minus I dash. I minus I dash. So this we got 10 milliampere and I dash is 2.5 milliampere. That comes 7.5 milliampere. This is a current through Zener diode. Okay. Here we got the answer. I hope it's clear. So this kind of a numerical sometimes comes in the entrance exam. Okay. Soon we will meet with the next video on physics.